Number 10. Catfish. The majority of the catfish we have on the markets are imported and not up to standard of cleanliness and quality. Many antibiotics enter the fish's system due to the poor quality of water. The subpar water conditions affect the consumer in the end. In addition, catfish have low mercury levels, which, when consumed for a long time, could cause nervous system decline. Combine that with how consumers end up eating antibiotics that the fish accumulates, and it might be sensible to reduce intake. Number 9. Tuna Tuna is common across the US and the world due to its availability. Tuna comes in various species, and they're all nutritious and offer good fats. The many canned tuna versions are filled with albacore tuna, the most dangerously high mercury-infused tuna. Tuna accumulate toxic mercury through their flesh as a result of industrial pollution. The positive effects of eating tuna do not negate the high levels of mercury in it. The mercury can cause complications for pregnant women and their infants. One must avoid tuna due to the risky levels of mercury. Mercury is credited with finger curling, coordination problems, and cognitive impairment. Number 8. Tilapia Tilapia is the most consumed fish in the US. Notwithstanding, China is the primary producer of tilapia. However, the US imports 4.3 million pounds of fresh tilapia fillets at about $12.6 million per month. There are good sources of nutrients in tilapia. However, tilapia has toxic chemicals that cause inflammation and weaken the immune system. There are farms where tilapia ingest chemicals and fecal matter as part of the diet. Therefore, tilapia leads to heart disease. Tilapia is a delicacy of the people, but it needs to be properly spiced to prevent unhealthy fats. Americans ate about 475 million pounds of tilapia last year. Number 7. Salmon Salmon is a notable delicacy in the seafood world. PCBs and arsenic are found in salmon. Also, there are high mercury levels in the fish. Lastly, salmon farming is not the most hygienic of the fish farming cultures. Farmers like to increase production without improving logistics. As such, you would find many salmon swimming within the same small space and through their fecal matter and waste. Meatonomics has confirmed that young children, women, and nursing mothers should avoid farmed salmon. It reduces a person's IQ and other cognitive and behavioral effects. Number 6. Swordfish Swordfish is at the top of the predator list in its ecosystem. Therefore, swordfish absorb a high percentage of mercury in the sea creatures. Mercury levels increase when the fish grows. On the other hand, swordfish is rich in omega-3 fatty acids, vitamin B12, and zinc. It is also low in fat, and doctors recommend that one eats swordfish in limited amounts. Women and children are also the most affected by swordfish mercury. Pregnant women and those who intend to get pregnant are the most affected by this mercury ingredient. The FDA advises that mercury could cause renal and neurological difficulties. Number 5. Shark It's not uncommon to find people eating sharks in various parts of the world. Aside from eating the most dangerous fish in the ocean, you would be dealing with other health-related problems. Shark is high in mercury. Aside from absorbing mercury from the ocean, they also absorb it from the rest of the prey they find. Their prominence in the fish chain makes them the highest absorber since they're at the top of the food chain. Shark Conservation Australia noted that sharks are dangerous in both life and death. Samples reveal that sharks contain many toxins. For example, high methyl mercury concentrations are found in sharks. Health effects include lymphoma, Parkinson's disease, and Alzheimer. Meanwhile, ciguatera, a food poisoning outbreak, also occurs through shark fish. One could also be absorbing DDT and PCBs. Number 4. Chilean Sea Bass Chilean sea bass is fortified with mercury. If you're afraid of mercury poisoning, then your attempts to avoid it should start with not eating any Chilean sea bass. We've spoken about other fish species having a high methylmercury level. However, the Chilean sea bass has the highest. The fish feeds on other smaller fishes that already have high mercury levels. Additionally, they also search the ocean floor for food and sometimes encounter mercury in the waste. 
In spite of this, Chilean sea bass is rich in flavor. The taste sells this delicacy, and it makes it irresistible. In fact, the high demand for Chilean sea bass has made this species almost extinct. Medical Daily published a warning, especially to pregnant women, against Chilean sea bass. According to them, seafood complicates pregnancies, but Chilean sea bass has the highest rate of complications. In addition, they advise that the larger the fish, the more mercury they absorb and contaminate your system with. Number 3. Eel Eels live in chemicals and substances that are detrimental to human health. For instance, polychlorinated biphenyls are a man-made chemical that is present in electronic devices. Furthermore, PCBs are banned in the US. As such, they should be avoided entirely. Some eels eat fugu, a dangerous fish that causes respiratory problems when you eat their poisonous parts. Eels should not be featured in any meals. King Henry I of England died after famously eating a dinner of the flesh of eels. Eustace IV also choked on a plate of eels. Alexander III, who died from falling off his horse, also died after eating a plate of eels. Coincidence? We'll leave that to you to decide. Number 2. Live Octopus Parts of East Asia culturally eat live fish. There is no problem with that if the fish is not a danger to your throat and life. In Seoul, South Korea, a woman died from eating a live octopus in April 2010. She did not die immediately, but she stopped breathing and died 16 days later in the hospital. Although the police charged and convicted her boyfriend for strangling her, the High Court and Supreme Court acquitted him because there was enough evidence that the live octopus killed the woman. Although he received $190,000 from her death, he was not to blame that she ordered two live octopuses and almost choked to death instantly in the hotel room. The sad incident is evidence of why eating a live octopus or any other animal could be unhealthy and potentially deadly. Number 1. Blowfish Fugu, as the Japanese call blowfish, is a delicacy that can easily kill you. The fish could potentially kill you if you made one wrong cooking move. Therefore, to cook it at best, one should carefully remove all the deadly toxins. The lethal poison, tetrodotoxin, can be found in the organs like the skin, eyes, ovaries, and liver. The poison in the fish has no antidote, so one cannot survive consuming it. The parts that are poisonous need to be removed to prevent cross-contamination. In 2020, a Hong Kong man was critically ill after eating a blowfish. The 65-year-old suffered respiratory failure, general weakness, and facial numbness two hours after eating his lunch of pufferfish, also known as fugu. Please let us know what deadly animals you want us to talk about next.